So this is whenever I first found Mr. Coochie Baby injured and I called all these rehab facilitator places and everybody was making all these excuses as to why they couldn't take him and I was not gonna let him die so I put him in this hoodie. We went to PetSmart and I was like, I gotta take care of this little guy myself. So this is our journey. So I've had my baby for about two weeks. There he is. My mom stumbled upon the nest of babies. There was three. She saw the mom though. We left them alone completely. A couple hours later, I had seen my dog in the yard playing with something. I had him inside for probably like 30 minutes just trying to calm him down, wipe any blood off because I wasn't just gonna put him back in the nest like that. I go back to the nest to try to put him back. It's later and it's dark and they're gone. They're all gone. And I'm like, oh, great. So I don't know if the mom moved them or if another predator got them. It wasn't my dog because we put her back inside, but I'm pretty sure an animal came and got them because the mom or rabbit keeps on running around the yard and I think she's looking for her babies, which is really sad. And I tried to introduce Bougie Baby back with her and she wouldn't take him or anything so but this is going to be the journey and disclaimer i don't know too much about rabbits and everything i'm learning all this online don't go messing with wild rabbits nest for about the first week i would keep the baby in this blanket and i would keep him next to me in my bed and sometimes i would wake up <laughs> He would be on top of me. Now I have him in this little box. So he has like some shedding and stuff in here. I would take him in my car traveling with me sometimes because I'm busy and I had to go places and you know, I had to take care of him. Let him travel in this little Gucci box. It's actually so cute. Like I know he's a bunny, but he just didn't really care. Like he was chill with everything, which is good. It might be a little hard to see in here, but I just want to show you guys him. So he's right there. He basically just eats a bunch of clovers and dandelions. Oh, he's coming out. Hey, baby. In the day, he stays in this little nest that we have for him. The formula I'm doing now, one scoop of the kitten milk replacer, like a third of this, one and a half things of water. The Benamac Plus, I just use one fourth of a teaspoon to put in there. Make sure you syringe feed them. They usually drink like one milliliter starting out. I pretty much just gave him as much as he wanted. Didn't force feed him or anything. Pretty much just takes what he wants. Now I feel like anytime I feed him, he probably gets like a whole syringe. He eats clovers and little flowers and dandelion. Let him eat how much he wants. He went from living in a dirt hole to this. Something he does every night. He gets out of his nest and he comes to this mirror on my bed and just likes to sit here. But he likes to stare at himself in the mirror. Like this is a nightly thing. It's literally 6 a.m. He's supposed to be over there. So I just woke up and he's been running around my room and he's trying to like climb the walls. He constantly stares at himself in the mirror. He's literally gotten so big, you guys. Look at his ears. Baby, <laughs> you're so cute. Come on, come up here. Oh, baby, come here. Come here. All over the place. Oh. Yes. oh my goodness okay so there's this youtube channel i was watching last night and basically this girl has her bunny like a free range bunny in her apartment it's like a cat you know you can litter box train it which i mean who freaking knew I just went to pet smart and i'm going to show you guys exactly what i got and what you will need to have a free range bunny okay so i bought this pet bedding and i put it in this cardboard box here because this is where he likes to go i also bought this little hay feeder so he knows this is where he goes to the bathroom while he eats this is the type of food that I got him, just this like Timothy Hay. I also have a bowl of just, you know, grass and flowers from outside that I will be putting right here. They say that bunnies usually get the gist early. It should take like two weeks to be official. Baby, are you just so excited right now? Oh my God. <laughs> cutest freaking thing i've ever seen i'm in love with him i'm obsessed with yeah. him the litter box training has gone perfectly smooth he just has this little nook right there and he has his nest in this little blanket like the cutest thing you've ever seen like, so i really do think that there's like a reason he came into my life i'm not gonna say how or in what way basically he revealed the biggest snake that i've ever known in my entire life to me okay so this is my baby gucci baby that's his official name he's big he's healthy he loves his life he just loves living in luxury do you love it yes you do he loves the luxury life. i can pay with better least so i can live in luxury looking in the mirror i thank god for what i'm about to be you beefing with my enemy does not make you a friend of me girl so he has officially adopted my sweatpants drawer baby you're so sweet I have had Mr. Gucci Baby for a year now, and I can honestly say he's living his most happiest, bestest life ever. At first, I was scared because I didn't know what I was doing, but I'm very proud of myself and proud of him and how far he's come. He is the best part of my life and honestly probably the only guy I'll ever love. I can't wait to continue on our journey together.